Hello everyone, my name is Teo Salvador. Welcome to Reactor Tech. This is a game that came out back in August, and uh, I've been keeping an eye on this game and kind of just thinking about playing it. I know nothing about this game except for the fact that we're supposed to build a power plant. So with that said, let's just start a new game and see what this has to offer. Okay, so I have created a name for the company, Potenza Power Company, which if you're Italian, this might be a really lame name because Potenza is the Italian, I might be saying that word wrong, Potenza is the word, f the Italian word for power, I think, I think. Um, that's, that's the name I'm going with. And obviously our name, Matteo, that's me, yay. When you start a new game, your past save will be erased. I don't like that too much. We have simplified, uh, moderate or crisis. Um... I guess we'll go with moderate for this one, and let's get started. Don't forget about fuel. Fuel tends to run out at the most inopportune moment. Watch out for its quantity. Okay, and here we are. Okay, I thought it would give me a tutorial. Maybe it doesn't give me a tutorial. What do we have here? Um, no power unit, okay. Interesting. All right, so the game just throws us right in. Um, I, if I hit escape and I go up here, there's this introduction menu. Look at all this crazy stuff. Um, introduction. Welcome to PowerTech, a power plant construction and management simulator. Your goal is to build the largest energy company in the world. Um, here you have access to the construction of different buildings and utilities. Uh, engineering, machine installation, detailed management, a power plant, and disaster. Start building your own power plant by following this start guide. Use F2 for the quick access menu. Alright. Um, construction. In front of you, there is an area where you can place your power plant. We suggest you to build... We suggest you to build your first power unit. To do this, go to the architectural menu and click on the button with the image of the power unit. Now you have a building layout attached to your cursor. You can reset it by clicking on the PCM. Don't know what that is. Or you can install it by click... Oh, PCM. Left on the LKM. Place it by clicking... Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That's maybe what that is. Uh, place a cursor on an empty space and press LKM to start construction. Um, to make room, you can cut down the forest and soon even acquire a new area. All right, very cool. Um, all right. So let's see how this works. Um, construction and power unit. We have power storage, reservoir, plot, destruction, water pipes, power lines, and warehouses. All right, I guess we can just place the... Can I not place it up there? I guess I can't do that. I will just place it right there then. And it looks like money is draining away. Now what? Destruction mode. How how do we operate this? Grid. Oh, look at that. Okay. Plots. Ah. Power network. Water networks, which I'm guessing that that's what the water network is. So right here we have our pump. Um, I didn't place this down. Oh. Install a new water pump. Increase the water spreading distance. Oh, okay. So this is where water is. You can see it right there. Um, are they just going to build this? That is the question. Here, uh, con connections. I built that. Now what? Oh, do I click on it, maybe? No? How do I, how do I operate this? We play. It's paused. There we go. Now it's building. Okay, very good. Um, what is this? Okay, that's that. All right. It, it's day one, and it's 1,300 hours. Is this one the day? No, oh, no, this is the hour, maybe. No? Maybe? What is this? Why did the area all of a sudden turn all smoky? Control panel. Uh, radiation. Ooh. Can we build a nuclear power plant? I think we can do. Um, I think we can eventually. Power lines. No upgrades. Okay. While this is doing that, how about we read? Um, connections. Buildings may need access to electricity or water, or they will not function. You can observe the distribution of networks by using color-coded zones. Use the visibility section of the architectural menu to hide unnecessary details in construction mode. To get acquainted with the building's connection requirements, click on it and turn your eyes to the right upper corner uh, with the indicators. They're indicated, they indicate the absence or presence of required communications. Eh, okay. Go to... Uh, click on it. Uh, okay. So, if I do this, is that is that what it's talking about? Power. How about this one? Is it talking about this, maybe? The top right corner. Maybe it is talking about this. 
The object receives water. The, it's connected to the power grid. All right. Okay, so I'm thinking this is what this says. It receives water. How do I do this? Construct a new se sector for engineering parts. The power unit can accommodate four sectors. So is this operating? Who's that? Is that a person? Uh, is this operating? Why? Wow, this is really messing with my eyes. What? What is this? Hold on, I gotta go into the settings. Is there a way I can change this? Look at this! So, there's other companies in the game, it seems, and we are number three! Yay! We're number three, apparently! Uh, Potenza Power Company's number three, Mark's Energy and Sunshine Energy. Very interesting. Is this multiplayer? Is this multiplayer? I'm kind of curious. I feel like it is. Uh, alright. Fair enough. So, is this working now? I don't know if this is working. <laughs> Heat resistance, install the more powerful thermal protection. Raise the temperature limit of the power plant. Oh. Oh. Power plant is turned on. Okay. And is that doing anything? Aeration, it blows through all sectors. Emergency ventilation is not installed. Alarm, disable alarm. Okay. Uh, connections, buildings they need... <coughs> Didn't we already read this? Okay. Uh, resources. For your power plant to work, you need to have fuel. When you open the resources menu, you'll notice several types and kinds of fuel. In the future, you'll be able to switch to liquid and nuclear fuel, but at the moment, only wood is available. Order fuel by clicking on the appropriate button besides ordering. You can get fuel by cutting down trees. To select the fuel you want to use, click on the large fuel image highlighted in yellow. Wood is automatically selected. Hey, okay. So if I go here, I can buy wood. Okay. How much? We buy 10. All right, we buy 10. Uh, oh, that's wood. That's water pipes. Is it automatically building things? Is, is that, is that constructing water pipes? I don't like this. Why is that there? Okay, interesting. So, what is this? Banking. All right. Let's read the next thing. Uh, research. Your power plant must constantly evolve to keep up with the times. Go to the research tree in the escape menu, and you'll be presented with research tree. Uh, you need to open. First, set your monthly research budget using the appropriate buttons. Click on the available research and set it as your research goal, a uh, research target. Now your company will be busy working on the research you have chosen. Try not to forget about the need for constant developments. Okay. Very cool. Uh, time control, so that you don't have to be bored for an entire century while playing. Is this really what it is, an entire century? Every second of the real world is equal to a whole day in the reactor tech, really. You can control the passage of time thanks to the special menu in the corner of the screen. Set a comfort com comfortable speed of time to make the world come to life. Power units begin to build and research is conducted. Once you've completed the research construction, you can stop the time again to continue the learning curve. Okay. Since Reactor Tech is not only an economic simulator, it includes a power plant simulator with detailed control and complex generation mechanics. Uh, go, into the uh, go into the engineering menu to install the first parts of your new power plant. Turn to the parts selection and mount the boiler to the three turbines. Ooh. Okay. The boiler will use fuel to create heat and evaporate water, while the turbines use steam to generate. Ooh. Look at this. How do I operate this? Wait, what? Hold on. I got her. Oh. Since... Go to the engineering menu to install the first parts into your new power plant. Turn to the parts selection menu and mount the boiler with three turbines. Hey. Oh. So, let's turn that off then. How do I operate this? Coal burner. It's not. Detail is not researched. Wait, what? Hold on. What is this music? Why is this music so ominous? All right, so I have been looking around, and to be honest, I'm kind of stuck. I'm gonna hit start. Designing the architecture, the power plant, coming registration, okay. Now what? What is that? Oh, there's a deploy uh, art artisanal assessment. Development of our own steam boilers and steam turbines with the electric generator. Discover new parts needed for power generation. What does this do? How do I operate this? What? 
Wait, what? How do I how do I do this? Hey, okay. Well, it appears that we're really good with experience. <laughs> yeah, we're going down. Potenza's at 15%. We're almost at the bottom. All right. Number two, scientific research, re realization, realization, sale, and purchase. Some researchers require material investments. Okay. All right, let me try something. Uh, increase research budget by 25 units. Can I... Am I able to... How do I research things? What is... Like, what is... Oh, shift to purchase. Sorry, research development. Oh, okay. Oh, so maybe I already have this. Sell research. Oh. Oh, so now I hit this. Research is chosen. And how long does that take? Uh, how long does that take? Like, if I, if I speed up time... What does this do? Interesting. Okay, so we're, based on this, I think we're researching. Um, hopefully we are researching. Are those little workers? We have little workers working around. How big is this map, by the way? Okay, so the map is a fair size. Kind of has some 3D, 2D trees kind of going on. Uh, there's some really weird graphics I'm going to have to change a little bit. There's little animals as well. Alright, uh, is there a way... Okay, I guess we're researching this. Um, and then after I finish researching this... Because, see, I need to get a turf... Oh, there we go. Now what does that do? Am I able... Oh, I can get a tur... A boiler. Okay. Wait. Uh. Okay, now I did that. And it wants me to get three... Uh, whatchamacallit. So, this thing says, go to engineering, turn... Mount the boiler with three turbines. So that's a boiler, and now I need turbines. How do I operate turbines? Uh, what's that? Oh, heat deflectors. This is all heat stuff, isn't? Oh, this is boilers. Oh, turbines. Okay. I need one, two, three. There we go. And is that now going to make this operational? Okay, hopefully this is going to make this operational. Is there a way I can, do, like, remove clouds in this game? Uh, Alright. Ooh, grids, steel pipes, accounting, advanced training, additional staff training for basic subjects related to office management, construction, engineering, increases the size of research available budget, quality parts, improvement of own mach machines by partial replacement of parts. Okay. Steel pipes, replaces old rusty pipes with steel pipes, installs new equipment, increased water delivery capacity, and pressure resistance. All right, um, let's go to the control panel. And if I start this, reduce the power of all engines. Is this operational now? Is it, are you operational? Water supply. Wait, is that, does that turn it off or turn it on? Are we, are we making power now? I don't think we're making power. Okay, I figured something out. So I've been here kind of just looking at everything. We have built some turbines and we have wood. I'm going to buy some more wood because I think that having 50 units of wood will be better. Um, and what's this? First prestige. Your enterprise, this enterprise has paid attention to you. You have received a 10% discount on all products on this enterprise. Okay, very cool. So if when we're here in the control panel, we have the power plant turned on, yeah? Now, if you look down here, these are actually movable. So you can um, basically, I guess, move these up. I, I don't actually know what this does, to be honest, but I'm just going to move these up anyways. Controls the reflective power neutron reflectors. Okay, I'm guessing that probably for nuclear power then? Uh, probably, yeah, heat up with the boilers water supply to the boiler so maybe that's not that then maybe not what happens if i turn this up are you are you going to start functioning huh like is that maybe 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 i'm wrong maybe maybe, maybe i'm not right well maybe not uh actually now that the game's unpaused maybe i am right oh look at that there we go so it's doing something uh look at that do you see that oh look we are producing stuff uh, we're producing heat, apparently. I don't know what that does. Uh, I feel like this could be bad. Um, 
yeah, I feel like that could be really bad. All right, let me take this down a little bit. And the power is starting to go down. All right, I don't think any... I, okay, so I think what this is, is this is trying to control um, the other boilers. So if we have water boilers, it'll be here. If we have... Um, hmm, maybe I'm wrong on this. Uh, turn this down. How do I turn this down? Like, is there... Shift to speed up. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's better. Oh, no, it did do something, didn't it? Neutron... Reflective neutron reflectors. But isn't that for nuclear power? Uh... Okay. Look, it is doing something. But I don't think it's producing us electricity, which is kind of interesting. Uh, all right. Hmm, interesting. All righty. Uh, let's see this. So if I... No, I just sold that. Dang it, I didn't mean to do that. Ugh, game. Crap, that's costing a lot of money. Look at that. We only have four, four, four point nine thousand dollars left. All right. Um, let's move this up. So I think if I take this up to 80, let's just take this all the way up here. Ooh, okay. See, look, that's starting to get really hot. All right, I'm going to take that back down. Ah, look at that. We are producing power. Very good. All right, we have power. Um, I'm going to take that up a little bit. Look at that. See how those are red? Those are red, and the heat is actually very good. All right, so let me just take this up to 75. The heat's going to increase. Power is somewhat increasing. Let me, let me lower the water down to 30. Let's see what that does. That... Okay, interesting. So this game has a lot of management to it. You're not just plopping and going ahead. You actually have to, like, manage this, which is kind of interesting. All right, so we're producing power. Um, are we earning money? Like, what, what are we actually doing now that we are doing this? How are we doing? Oh, look at all these power companies that have existed now. Plenergy, Light... Light electricity. Are these multiplayer? Is this multiplayer? I, I I kind of almost think this is multiplayer. And our popularity has obviously gone down. Look at that. <laughs> power. Show the history of the power produced by your company over the past 12 years. Zero percent. There it is. Yep. We are at the bottom. Except for... Um... Oh, yeah. Look at that. We're not even on the board. That's how bad we are. Okay. Well, this is a learning curve. I don't know what I'm doing. So... I guess we're here to figure this out, all right? I'm gonna take this up to 80. Let's see, because I imagine that. Oh, look at that! We have smoke. That's something. And the power's going up. Now, okay. Heat exchanger. Like, what if I was to move this up? Okay. We're, we're producing power. Now, that's going to that's gonna make that go back down. All right, let's take that to 20 then. Hopefully, this thing doesn't get too hot. Because I think if this gets too hot, I think it will catch on fire and explode. Which obviously wouldn't be a good thing. Uh, all right, how do we earn... Uh, oh, credit. We can take loans. Expense account. A debt account for... Oh, paid once a year. Okay. Uh, all right, let's take a look at this then. Uh, level 2 scientific research. We kind of already worked with that a little bit. Figured that stuff out. Um, quality parts, contracts. In addition to building, researching, and managing the power plant, you have to deal with accepting contracts. Open the contracts menu. Select one of the available contracts. Once you have read the terms, you will know how much power you have to transmit per day or over time. If you violate the contract in the slightest, you will be fined. You will lose your reputation. Your popularity will not change. Your popularity will not change? Oh, rejection of an accepted contract is considered a breach of contract? Use the fixation not to lose the contract in the list of new contracts. Okay. All right, let's take a look at this then. So, an agreement between your company. How... Mr. Mateo Salvador, <laughs> what is this? Our company, uh, Harry and Company, requests services of your energy company, Potenza Power Company. If you fulfill the contract, we'll issue 5K marks. This is German, apparently. Um, although I don't think they use the mark anymore. Um, if they don't, they use, I think it's just the euro nowadays, but I might be completely wrong on that. If there is an insufficient implementation, we'll be forced to reduce your reward. Uh, the duration of the contract must be equal to six months after you complete the contract. 
uh, you'll be awarded and released from your obligations. For the entire duration of the contract, from your side, you must be transferred. Oh my gosh. If you do not fulfill, you'll be forced to pay a fine of 11 marks. 11,000 marks. It's 1904. Okay, so it makes sense. Uh, lock. Lock the contract. One fix will not disappear. Alright, I will, uh... We have an alarm? I have an alarm going off. Alright, I think we need to we need to cool down the power plant. Alright, we need to stop everything. Because I think the thing was starting to flip out a little bit. Alright, let's take that up to 70 and... Let's take that down to there. Alright, interesting. So this thing started to freak out a little bit. Alright, uh, what are you? Our company, Lie Streets Request Services. You'll fulfill a contract, 20k marks. You first... Alright, I guess I'll take this. What is this? Apply. Okay. Oh. Okay, and am I going to start earning money from this? Question is. Alright, uh... Interesting. So this game has a lot of stuff to it. Um, this might be a really terrible episode, but it's just the start, so, you know, maybe, maybe what we'll do is we'll restart in the next episode, like, I don't know, maybe we'll start fresh next episode, and we'll be like, alright, now we kind of know what we're doing, and we can at least kind of help things a little bit more. So, is this going to help us earn money? I have signed this. What are you? Our company, uh, Dream District, requests the services of your energy company by requesting 2.1 gigawatts until the end of the uh, 18 months. Upon the passing of the period, you'll be released from obligations, trying out until marks. All right. Uh, how about this one? Uh, power company, Potenza, blah, blah, blah. Josh's gas station is interested in the service of your power plant. Jesus. Uh, it's determined to sell until 18 months of 21 marks. Okay. Now, what about you? Do you just say 5.9 marks? Maybe this won't be that bad. Uh, this is a lot, though. Alright. Uh, okay, I guess... Shoot, alright. I guess... I... No, I'm not going to apply that. Uh, I guess... Uh, I guess I'll apply that. Alright, all right, I guess we'll apply that. Now, if I go here... Yeah, I don't know. Alright, you know what? That's, that's going to do it for this episode. We're just going to end it here. We have something started. In the next episode, we'll come back. We'll figure out exactly what all this other jazz is. For now, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Sir, peace!